Hello, it's Christopher. It is time for our November craft. We are going to make us a pumpkin out of construction paper, staples, or if you have these little uh, braids, brads, I think is what they call them. You can use those, I just use staples. Uh, green and orange paper, you really only need one green and one orange, unless you're gonna make multiples. Uh, so, <clears throat> what we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna make this and you can use this. It's our, uh, what are we calling this? Our thankful pumpkin, I guess is what we're gonna call this. You can use this uh, on your table for Thanksgiving if you'd like. If everybody makes one, we can. you can put it on your table setting. All right, mine doesn't stand up very well. We're gonna try this again. Okay, so you're gonna wanna make two small strips of green paper first. And I just use the long side of the green to do that. And then cut out two leaves. So you can do any size that you want. I did slightly bigger for the second one. And then on your orange piece of paper, you want eight of these inch-ish strips. The first one I did, I cut long ones, but long ways, but I think that was too long. So uh, this one I'm cutting the short end. Uh, and like I said, you're just gonna do about an inch or so. Doesn't have to be perfect. Okay. Once we have those cut, we're going to write on them. So you want to say, put things that you're thankful for. So um, I have a few that I did. So I put, I'm thankful for hugs. I'm thankful for my family. Whatever you would like. Maybe, and you want to try and put them in the center because we're going to staple the end. So we don't want to cover like I did on here. Um, so let's see. I am thankful... for God, and let's see, what's something else you're thankful for? Are you thankful for your toys, your friends? What are you thankful for? I am thankful for The mountains. Whatever you want to put. Okay. So, once you have all of those, we're going to lay them out and staple them. So, this is going to be the top. <clears throat> so, you want to lay them out like this. And you do not, and this is not 100% easy. Okay. At least for me, it's not easy. You want to just overlap them, and we're going to staple them together. Now, by all means, do what makes it easiest for you as far as doing a couple staple, doing a couple staple. I'm going to try and do this. I have one more. like that like so kind of evenly spaced but i'm not doing the best job here okay and then you're going to staple or put your bread in the middle might be easier to do the brads but i'm gonna put this on top okay i i wrote that one too close but it's okay it'll be on top all right so like this And we're going to staple like that. Okay. And then you're going to take them, flip it, and do the same thing on this end. This is going to be your bottom. <clears throat> okay. 
Oh no, I missed one. Oh no. Okay. Which one is this? Like this. Let's put it there. Maybe like that. Okay, let's do this. Now I have no idea why my first one is lopsided, so hopefully this one will not be lopsided. I'm not sure what I did to make it lopsided. So what kind of things, while we're doing this, what are you most excited about Thanksgiving? Do you like Thanksgiving? It's one of my favorite holidays. Christmas is my favorite, of course, but I'm sure you've heard me say that more than once now. It, it really is my favorite. I mean, I start decorating right after Halloween, so you know I'm serious about it. But what is your favorite thing about Thanksgiving? I love getting with family, seeing people I haven't seen in a while maybe, but also the food. Okay, that's not as bad. Oh, that's not as bad. It's a little wobbly. Again, I don't know why. <laughs> But it's okay. Um, okay, so yeah, I like the food. I like uh, seeing people, catching up, that kind of thing. Just, it's a lazy day where you can just sit around. It's nice and warm and toasty and all the good food and pumpkin pie. and Yeah, so one of your leaves, we're going to read, we're going to put who, we're, who, who it is. So by who. So by Christopher. And that way... If you use this for your table setting, you know where you're sitting, right? And then the year. <clears throat> that way you can keep it and you know when you did it, okay? So we're gonna do that. And that's gonna go on the top. Now, these are huge leaves, now that I think about it. And again, I think no matter what you do, it's going to cover a little bit of it, but that's okay. So I should have stuck with the small leaves my second go around, but I got excited for leaves. Okay, boom. Okay, so now your strips. These are gonna be the curly cues. If you've ever seen a pumpkin still growing, <clears throat> they have little vines and stuff. So this is gonna be reminiscent of the vines. So we're gonna take a pick pencil and just start here and then you're just gonna roll it like that so I'm rolling it not very well but I'm rolling it you just kind of want it to curl so it doesn't have to be perfect when you're rolling it right Okay, boom, look at that. So now, you have little vines. And you don't have to do these if you don't want to, but if you do use them, then you just kind of, again, use another staple. And if you're really talented, you can do all some all in one staple, but I'm not that talented, so I have to do this in steps or I'm not gonna get down, okay. So like that, and that got sort of a, I missed the, one of them. So we're gonna try this like this. You might want to have a parent help you, at least to hold on to some stuff for you while you staple or whatever. It can be your lovely assistant. There we go, okay. So there's my thankful pumpkin, and I'm going to put this on my table for Thanksgiving, and everyone can see what I'm thankful for. All right. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, stay tuned for December, Advent, stuff, a lot of stuff's happening. Uh, we're going to have weekly stuff that your parents will get. Um, for you and for them and there'll be a, an extra video everything will drop in the first three weeks but I think we're gonna do two stories and 
I haven't 100% decided on the third video, but those are all on our YouTube page. The Advent Weekly uh, activities and devotion will come out. Uh, I will send it to email, so uh, your parents' email, okay? All right, so I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you make your pumpkin. If you want to share a picture with the office, uh, that would be great. Uh, you can, or you can email it to me, and I'll share it through our newsletter and online, okay? All right, thank you. Bye.